I'm actor Joey Rulo. This is our second edition of Inside 2016. We want to bring to you an easy, updated way of reviewing what's going on with the presidential primary for 2016. So far, some of the new things since our last show, we had mentioned different people who had thrown their hat in the ring for the primary. In the past, I had brought up the fact that Walker has not yet, at that time, uh, basically formed a pack. Walker, to this point right now, has made a move forward. He spoke at CPAC. He got a very good uh, response. There's a lot of people that are talking around about a Walker Rubio ticket. Rubio is vice president. It's becoming very appealing to a lot of the conservatives uh, based on the fact that Rubio could draw in a great Latino vote, which is a weakness with the Republican Party. Um, another really big point that came out at the CPAC was that it looks like Donald Trump from the past has basically mentioned that he was going to run, and like in my last show I said I wouldn't mention that he's a formidable candidate at this point, it looks like Donald Trump is saying that he's going to actually form a PAC and he's going to start raising money to show himself as a serious candidate. Um, basically, Hillary Clinton rumors are on the Democratic side that Hillary Clinton is going to be announcing her candidacy soon. It looks like Hillary might have some issues coming up with an email scandal, uh, basically using her personal email instead of her uh, Secretary of State government email, which they're saying that that is a uh, breach of security and that it basically could have something to do with transparency. Um, the issues that are kind of formulating around the Republican campaign, there really aren't any. The last time we spoke, they were pretty much talking about um, vaccines. Um, and pretty much now the issues are really just back and forth. Uh, different things are coming out on different candidates, which again, we don't really want to go in depth on the negatives about candidates. Uh, we're going to bring you another update probably in the next week or so when there's something to report. Um, for now, I'm just trying to give you an update on what I've already reported. Um, the straw poll for CPAC showed Rand Paul as the winner. Um, Jeb Bush did not do well as expected. Um, rumor has it he did bust people in, um, as did Rand Paul. The CPAC vote to give you an idea of that weight is not necessarily an indicator of whether someone's going to win president or not. Um, based on the past, Rand Paul had won the CPAC poll, I believe, the last couple of years, and he never won the primary. Again, I want to thank you for joining me. This is being brought to you so that instead of having to weed through and research and try to bring yourself up to date. I'm pretty much bringing you up to date with what's been going on the last couple of weeks with the presidential primary campaign. It's not formally rolling yet. Um, there hasn't been any changes. Pretty much nobody has announced that they're not going to run from the last show. If you want to review the first show, um, everyone is pretty much still in. But, you know, the two new ones that, you know, looks like Walker has made a commitment, and it looks like Donald Trump is trying to change the perception that he talks about running by saying that he's going to form a PAC, which again we discussed. Uh, Governor Christie had, uh, formed a PAC, um, leadership PAC, um, which by the way just met the other day. Um, thank you again. I look forward to seeing you guys on the next show for 2016. And we just wanted to bring you a real short one, and I'm here editing myself. Thank you, and hope to see you soon. Thank you.